before we start this episode of FWE, we just want to remind you of some things that happened last night at All Elite Wrestling, AEW. Um, Hayden was pissed off at Chris Jericho after what has been happening for the past few weeks and attacked him before his match against, uh, before his rematch for the AEW Championship, making the uh, match uh, just be cancelled. He was trying to get his rematch against um, John Moxley after he had lost the championship to him. And then Hayden came out with Moxley's music, ran into the ring. Jericho was shocked. He didn't know what's going on. And then Hayden just kept on beating the shit out of him. As you can see here, loads of those strikes in the corner. Got Jericho up. Did a suplex. The security did not know about this attack yet. Because Cody Rhodes was only coming down just to um, see what was going on because Moxie had not came out. Turns out Moxie was attacked and tied up. We wonder who did that. Tied up to the wall. He then went out. Well, he, he at this time, he had only just found out about um, Moxley. So he was going to his office to find the ring. Well, to see what was happening with Jericho because he would just been waiting in the ring. And then he saw that Jericho was being attacked viciously by Hayden. The referee was trying to break it up, but he just couldn't get close. And Jericho was just being on and off, like destroyed. We had sneaking, sneaking suspicions that Knight was also there. Because Knight is a part of this rivalry. Jericho tried to retreat. And Hayden badly hurt his back there. But the reason why, the, mostly the reason why we're showing you this is not to show you how big this is. It's because... Boom, there's the moonsault Hayden signature move, apart from the wrist assault. And then Hayden hit this GKO, and unfortunately, he was taken away from by security and arrested. Yeah, anyway, we thought we'd tell you this uh, now, because Knight versus Harvey was just in the middle of this match. And yeah, well, we're not really, we're kind of at the beginning. Wait, no, no way! Stump! But not much was happening. So we thought we would, we would tell you about it. It's at the beginning of the match. And another one! Two stomps straight at the beginning. Wait, he's got a chair. This is an extreme rules night. You can get disqualified for having chairs. See, plan, and the referee has to take that out of the ring. Uh-oh. Harvey getting up. I guess Knight's like, sort of using the chair, almost. Knight, like, what is Knight doing? Like, he keeps on putting Harvey in positions. Knight, what's he doing, Harvey? Recovering the stomp! I think he tried to get the stomp on the chair. Is it enough? I think it is. Three stomps and it's over. One of the quickest matches Knight's probably ever had to face in his life. I mean, to be fair, half that match we was talking about Hayden being arrested from AEW security. Wait a minute. No way. No way. x Park is here. Telling Knight to suck it. Well, he's doing the signature thing of the DX. Signature symbol. X Pac is here. Come into the ring. Knight is ready for anything. X Pac now in the ring. Knight having a little dance. Is that is X Pac on Clutcher's side? 
Tell the Knights to suck it. Wait, no. X Factor. Oh, my God. Knight is laid out. X Pack celebrating on the ramp. Knight is not moving. Okay, now he is. Look at him now. He's charging after X Pack. Gets caught. X Factor. He's told to suck it again. Keeps on telling Knight to suck it. Uh oh. Where's X Pack? No, 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 no. Knight being brang to the stage now. The third X Factor! And he's celebrating with the suck it. Suck it. And X Pack just celebrates, telling Knight to suck it. Oh, breaks the headphones. And Knight is trying to recover. Poor man. Oh. What a surprise. X Puck is here. And he breaks. Wait, no, he doesn't. He steps on Knight's head this time. Wait a minute, what the hell? What the hell is Drew McIntyre doing here? Backstage, Jack was getting ready for his match. Drew McIntyre attacks Jack with a briefcase. Oh, he's got a chair. He's got a chair across the spine. Uh-oh. What's he doing? What's Drew doing? Oh, you don't want to do this, Drew. Thank God Jack got back up. Straight away. But Drew doesn't care. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, we looked for the concerto. But thank God. Thank God Jack got out of it. Just in time. He's got the briefcase now, Drew McIntyre to the back. Why are WWE superstars now here? Well, I say superstar, yeah, because X Pac and um, Drew McIntyre are here. Why are they here? Power bomb. Oh no. Onto the chair. Almost. Almost. Not actually onto the chair. Oh god, look at the parking lot. There's even more who's coming. Oh come on, Harvey. Just trying to get back to his car. Now just getting slammed on with a chair by Triple H. To the legs. And to think we actually let WWE superstars, as long as they paid, like, practice promos and stuff like that here. Now they're just attacking our superstars. So we've got X Park, Drew McIntyre, and Triple H all here tonight. Harvey runs away to his car. Wait a minute. Oh, you son of a bitch. You want a fucking match? You want a fucking match? There's one thing for you, Fox. Attacking my superstars. I'm allowed to. I'm part of their fucking brand. I'm the fucking manager. And I'm also a fucking wrestler. You want attention that bad because shitty ass WWE is dying, huh? You want attention so you'll take a, attack a little indie show, huh? Fucking bitch. Go.
That's right. I got out of jail today. And I'll tell you what. Let's have a match. Main event. No, actually, right now, let's have a match. Me and the Red Skulls taking on you, Drew McIntyre, and x Park. No denying it. Let's go right now. Here we go. This match has now started. It will be the main event of this show. It is the Red Skulls against Triple H. Well, let's just say Team WWE. Triple H versus Hayden. I think Hayden actually had a lot of respect for all these people on their team. But then they, they just randomly started attacking their um, people. And how did Hayden actually... How did Hayden actually get out of prison that quick? Honestly, a bit weird. Oh, I suppose it was only one attack. And he was part of a match, Chris Jericho. That Hayden was in, so uh, I guess it's not a big offence. Even though that is assault, but still, we won't question it. Big knee. And then, oh, beautiful Meteora. And what's this? Stunner by Alex. Triple H is outside the ring. Wait, what's the ref doing? The ref's getting in the way. Drew McIntyre with a dirty move. A cheap shot. Referee telling McIntyre to back off. Alex reversal. Look at these kicks by Alex. Don't forget that Knight and um, Ribby, who is, again, not 100% fit, We'll have to defend the Tag Team Championships against Frank and Alex at the Cosmic Mania. No matter what. And then Knight will have to go in a match with his total on the line and Jericho's for the FWE and Lightning Championship. What the hell is this? Beautiful Meteora. Tag to Drew McIntyre. The WWE Tag... Um, uh, tag Team? The WWE Champion. Drew McIntyre with a massive suplex. And a knife edge chop again. And now climbing onto Frank, beating him down. And a big stomp. What is he doing? Headbutt. And a stomp into the corner. Tag to X Puck. Tag to X Puck. He's in here. X handle. Big punch to the head. And just stomps on Frank. Frank looks like he's in pain with that knee. Tag to Triple H. He's doing what X Puck did. X handle. They're aiming for that arm. And a massive body slam. Tag to Drew McIntyre. The only champion in this match. Oh! Using the knee as a weapon. Now setting up Frank. X handle to the back. Frank, I don't even think, has had a single bit of offense in this match. Thrown off. Frank reverses. No, wait, wait, wait. Frank needs to make the tag here. Tag to Alex. What is Alex going to look for? Needs to continue on this momentum. Drop kick. Big one. Runs into the corner. Is that the same for you? x pack tries to catch Alex. Alex with another drop kick. Tag into the leader. Hayden. And Drew McIntyre realising the state that he's in. Tries to make the tag. Look at Hayden. Oh, working on that knee. They're trying to ground Drew McIntyre so he can't hit the Claymore or make a tag. Spear. Very good move. Remember, Hayden also uses the Claymore. Well, used to as his finishing move. Dancing leg drop. And now strikes. 
Yeah, he used to use it as his finishing move. Now he doesn't and a massive splash. What's he gonna look for here? Drew into the corner. Tag to Frank. What are they looking for? Looking for this move again. A massive knee. Throws Hayden into uh, McIntyre. Meteora into Frank. Throws everybody outside. Stunner! It happens again. But look at X Pac. Look at X Pac. Frank punches. Triple H punches. X Pac, he sees it coming. Oh! And now Drew McIntyre chucks Frank about. Frank rolls out the ring. Gets back in. Looks for a strike. Frank now on Drew. Backbreaker. He realised Drew McIntyre is so close to making a tag right now. Carries him away. Can't let McIntyre make a tag. This is the best chance they've got. This is the best chance for McIntyre to make a tag. Tag to Hayden. Tag to X-Pac. X-Pac runs. Hayden looks for a strike. Looks for a drop kick. Hayden from off the rope. Nice Hurricane Rana. Hayden from off the ropes. Big kick, 619. Taunts. X Pac replies with a massive shoulder outside the ring. Fast momentum for that part of the match. Hayden jumps into the ring. I nearly dropped something. Oh, the wrist assault! The wrist assault! Oh! The wrist assault on X Pac. And there's the elbow to finish it off. Spear to Triple H, punch to Drew McIntyre. Brings X Puck up. Into the corner. Tag to Frank. Elbow. Frank now. Oh, big punch. Hooks the leg on X Puck. Oh, no. Somehow that was not it. And Frank just watches X Park. Watching him crawl around. Is Frank letting it? Frank's letting him make the tag, I think. Well, he's letting him get off at least. What is Frank doing? He's just standing there. Taking all the punches. Hold on a minute, Alex has just ran into the ring and he's beating the shit out of X Pac. The, the referee has skipped to three. Alex now with strikes. I think Hayden whispered something to Alex. Yep, yeah, Alex has got a steel chair and he doesn't care. Steel chair to the midsection of X Pac. And a massive Dini T. That's the end of this episode of FWE. Called short because of the WWE attack. But yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed. And peace.